Hi everybody, this is Miss Heaney and today I'm going to be giving you a little more information on Virginia and the five geographic regions. So we have already learned about where these regions are and we've learned a lot about the different products and industries, but there's still a little bit more to learn about these five regions. To start us off, I want you to find on this map where the coastal plain tidewater region is. I hope that you could identify that the coastal plain tidewater region is over here. And there's a part here that is part of the coastal plain tidewater region, but it is called something different. Stop and think, what is the name of this? This is called the Eastern Shore. This is an extremely important part of Virginia. It is not connected to mainland Virginia and it's separated by a body of water. What is the body of water called that separates mainland Virginia from the Eastern Shore? This body of water is called the Chesapeake Bay and it separates mainland Virginia from the eastern shore. There's another body of water that borders Virginia and it's not the Chesapeake Bay. If you've been to Virginia Beach you've probably swam in this body of water. This is called the Atlantic Ocean. The Atlantic Ocean is a body of water next to Virginia that helps connect it to other countries. And we're gonna talk about those other countries way down the line. All right, let's talk a little bit more about the Coastal Plain Tidewater Region. You should already know that in the Coastal Plain Tidewater Region, this has flat, land, specifically low flat land. It is located near the Atlantic Ocean and the Chesapeake Bay, and it is east of the fall line. So here's our fall line, the Chesapeake, I'm sorry, the eastern shore and the coastal plain tidewater region are east of this line. Let's talk about our next region. Stop and think to yourself, what region is this? Yeah, this is the Piedmont region. We need to know that the Piedmont region has rolling hills and it is west of the fall line. So again, here's the fall line separating the Piedmont from the coastal plain and the Piedmont region is west of the fall line. We're gonna talk about our next region. What region is this? Yeah, this is the Blue Ridge Mountain region. And there's a lot of information we need to know about this region today. First off, what is the land feature of the Blue Ridge Mountains? The Blue Ridge Mountains are old, rounded, mountains. We definitely need to know that old rounded mountains. We need to know that this is part of the Appalachian mountain system. So if you've ever heard of the Appalachian mountains or the Blue Ridge mountains, we need to know that the Blue Ridge Mountain region is part of the Appalachian Mountain System. It is located between the Piedmont and the other region over here that we're going to talk about in just a second. But a huge thing we need to know about the Blue Ridge Mountain region is it is the source of many rivers. That is extremely important and it's going to come up often. So we can remember that the Blue Ridge Mountain region is the source of many rivers because we usually color it blue to help us remember Blue Ridge Mountains. 
The reason the Blue Ridge Mountain region is the source of many rivers is because when it rains, we're on big old rounded mountains and that water goes down the mountain and then it forms into rivers. So a lot of our rivers in Virginia start in the Blue Ridge Mountain region. Our next region is here. This is what region? Yeah, you should know that this is the Valley and Ridge region. And our geographic features is this is the Great Valley of Virginia. You really need to know that the Great Valley of Virginia is in our Valley and Ridge region. And it is located west of the Blue Ridge Mountains. And the Great Valley of Virginia is still kind of part of this Appalachian Mountain system that we talked about. We have one more region over here. What is this region called? Yeah, it's the Appalachian Plateau. We need to know that this is elevated flat land. So we know that the coastal plain tidewater region is low flat land, but the Appalachian Plateau is elevated flat land. That is what a plateau is. This is located in southwest Virginia. So here we have southwest. It's located in southwest Virginia. And only a small part of the plateau is located in Virginia. So we've learned about our regions, but now I've given you a little bit more information about each of these regions. Thanks for watching.